Uh, the president has ordered the reduction of civilian personnel uh, uh, at our embassy in Kabul uh, and the acceleration of the evacuation of Afghan special immigrant visa applicants from the country. Uh, to enable this safe, orderly reduction, the Secretary of Defense has directed the department to position temporary enabling capabilities to ensure the safety and security of U.S. and partner civilian personnel. I'm going to break this down for you uh, just real quick. The first movement will consist of three infantry battalions that are currently in the Central Command Area of Responsibility. They will move to Hamid Karzai International Airport in Kabul within the next 24 to 48 hours. Two of those battalions are United States Marines, and one is a U.S. Army battalion. The next movement will consist of a joint U.S. Army Air Force support element of around 1,000 personnel to facilitate the processing of SIV applicants. Initial elements of this uh, movement, of this element, uh, will arrive in Qatar in the coming days. The third movement is to alert and to deploy one infantry brigade combat team out of Fort Bragg to Kuwait, where they will be postured and prepared if needed to provide additional security at the airport. We anticipate those forces will reach Kuwait sometime within the next week.